Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to another Daily Market Report brought to you by Mike Bjork. Today is Monday. Hope you all enjoyed your wonderful weekend. Uh, it's been pretty hot around here in Southern California, but uh, we got really no economic news release scheduled for today, but, but we do got a lot for this week, so be prepared uh, so for some volatility. We got uh, retail numbers that come out this week. We got, um, I believe it's a uh, PPI and CPI numbers and some manufacturers. So we got a little mixture. Uh, so we had a light week, kind of a little, a little vacation, I guess, from the economic news released last week. But this week we got quite a bit. So just happens to be today's not one. So, all right, folks, we'll jump over to headline news here. And right now the uh, stock market is currently down. We saw the Dow down about 69 so far this morning. And uh, a lot of it, they're looking, basing it on uh, some numbers that they saw in Japan. So their Q2 numbers uh, did a sharp decline. They had about 5% growth in, uh, five, in, um, in the first quarter. They figured it would come down to about 2.7% roughly. And they dropped down to like 1.4. So about half of what their expectations were. Uh, so it, sharp, it, it dropped a lot more, a lot further than they anticipated really. So that's what's kind of spooking the market right now. So let's jump over to the bond market and see what interest rates are doing. We are here right here. We're currently up about 12 basis points. Now, don't be scared about this here, the Friday's numbers, as you see this big drop. Uh, this is actually, we were up about three basis points. We had what they call the bond rollover, and it was down about 21 basis points. And what that basically means is that uh, they package up the bonds that were sold for that month, and then they create new pricing for the next month. Uh, so... That's how the bond rates are working, uh, but it doesn't change the uh, pricing on the interest rate. So really there's no uh, price change uh, from what we opened up on uh, Friday here. And today, so technically we would probably be up closer about here if it wasn't for the bond rollover, be closer to the 10-day uh, moving average here. All right, folks, so interest rates are a little bit better today. And... Uh, Hopefully it continues to get a little better because we do have a few gaps here to close. We still have this gap here. and We still have this gap here to close up and uh, get above that uh, trend line. So I think I talked about on Friday we had like this little uh, trend line that's up this way. We, we On the 3.5, we needed to be above the 105.60 to keep above that. And uh, if you uh, right now, the, it's even below that. So. All right, folks. So right now, rates are better, and I will see you guys tomorrow. And thanks for stopping by. And uh, if you like these uh, videos, please stop on by MikeStanleyMarketReport.com. You'll see the videos there as well as you, you can subscri subscribe and have them emailed to you on a daily basis. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.